Hey guys, Lethal Leslie here, and today I'm going to be taking you to all 10 rock carving locations in Red Dead Redemption 2. It's one of the things that is required for getting 100% completion on the game, so let's get into it. So the first one we're going to be looking at is Left of Strawberry, right by the river Oangila, I think is how you say it, and it's right there where I am now, it's right in front of me, so I'm going to go off here now, and this is it on the map there, so if you, you can just see it glowing, and that is number one, let's go on to number two. The second location you're going to want to go to is right above Strawberry this time. And by the word West, it's literally, like I said, this, like right by the T in West. So that's where you want to be going for that one. Let's go and have a look at the actual thing you're looking for. So it's above you, so make sure you look for it. As you see, you can't see the um, clue if you do that. And then you want to press Inspect. Let's get on to the third one. So we're at location number three now. And the thing I would go off is New Hanover here. It's by the N in New Hanover. Zoom in, and then you want to have a look at flat neck station and go to the, this area where I am right now you should be able to spot it quite nicely it's right in front of me now let me show you it in game and this is what it looks like in game so we're going to go and inspect this one as number three on to number four and for this one I would look under the A in Amberino to start with until you find Mount Hagen then you want to just go ahead and click at the end of the trail and it's just near the end of the trail as you can see where I am here very easy to find this one um, Mount Hagen let's show you where it is actually in game and this is what it looks like in game so you're going to come up the path and you're going to see it straight away let's get on to the next one for number five you want to go between the b and the a in amberino and you if you go just below it you can see this river that just flows right up here and you're going to find it right at the top of the river on the wall so make sure you come in from the river area or something like that and you'll find it right here up above you on the wall and that is number five let's go on to number six number six is just below number five so it's very close as you see that one was there and it's just below if you like follow the river down, if you can get across here, you'll be able to get to this one quite nifty. And it's by the sea here. If you just follow the path around and then come off and up the hill, let me show you where it is in game. And this is what it looks like. So let's inspect it and move on to number seven. Location number seven is by Bakus Station or however you pronounce it and also by Fort Wallace. So make sure you're coming around the back and going right up the back of this mountain and you will find it up here. Do not come around the part by the river or you're not going to be able to find it. Let me go and show you where it is in game. As you can see, the river's all the way down there. We're here and the location is here for this one. So let's get on to the next one. Location number eight can be found right above the end in New Hanover. It's right along the train track. And yeah, it's actually this side of the mountains though. So come from the Moonstone Pond area. I came from just this road right here. And you can see this is where I've tagged. Let me show you what it looks like in game. And this is what you're looking like, looking for for this one in game. So let's go ahead and inspect and move on to the next one. So the penultimate one is right between the E and the R in Hanover. So you want to zoom in where I am, and it's by Elysium Pool, and it's right on the road. This one, so you don't even go, got to go off the beaten track at all, really. So just tag right where my horse is on the road, and it'll take you right to it. Let me show you where it is in game. As you can see, it's just up there, so you'll see it right when you come here. It's a massive rock. It's really cool. So we're going to go and inspect that one and move on to the last rock carving. And the last location you're going to want to go to is Roanoke. It's just above Ainsburg and just above where we've just been, actually. And, yeah, so you want, you're going to want to come from the left side on this one. So come up here and you'll see it. Let's go in game and have a look what it is. And you can see it's just up here. So let's inspect this one and move on to the next part. And that's all 10 rock carvings captured just like that. The next thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go to a post office and send them all away. Any of the post office will do. But if you have not started the mission, you're going to want to come to this area here first. And you'll see a question mark. I can't quite remember whether, whether it's left or right of this road. But it's right here somewhere. And you just come here, you'll start the mission. And then you'll go from there. Because there's someone who actually wants these pictures of these rock carvings that you've taken so if you haven't started the mission come here if you have go ahead and send them in the post office and that will be that one done guys i'm gonna leave that one there anyway if you like the video like the video subscribe if you want to see more thanks for watching as always and take it easy